Some of the coldest air of the season is on the way as we head over the next 36 to 48 hours. The National Weather Service has issued a freeze warning for the whole entire coastline of South Carolina, whether you're in the PD near Myrtle Beach, where my home is, or down here in the low country of South Carolina near the uh, great city of Charleston. The whole entire coastline of South Carolina is under a freeze warning, and it is going to be no joke considering how cold it is going to be tonight. Temperatures will be in the low to mid 30s right along the coastline, but as you head further away from the coastline inland, you're looking at temperatures below the freezing mark from 25 in Manning to 26 in Orangeburg, 29 in Somerville, 26 in Walterboro. As you head towards the coastline, 31 in North Charleston, 37 in Folly Beach, 30 in Goose Creek, right around that freezing degree mark in, 30, uh, in Mount Pleasant, 32 degrees, and getting up into the upper 20s as you head across the PD and, and on the border of South Carolina. So a very, very frigid night um, to say the least. Let's take a look at your bus stop forecast as you are heading out to work or school tomorrow morning. Have that jacket on hand because it is going to be very, very cold. Temperatures starting out in the 30s, so a very chilly start out to your Wednesday, to say the least. And it'll still be chilly as you're heading home. Temperatures only climbing into the mid to upper 50s, so overall a very chilly day, to say the least. On the weather map, high pressure and full, con uh, and full control forcing a lot of air to sink, and this is going to be leading to a very nice day as far as cloud cover goes, but a very chilly day. Temperatures only going to be topping out in the mid 50s everywhere you look, from 58 in North Charleston to 57 in Goose Creek, 55 in Monks Corner, 54 in Manning, 53 in King Street, 55 in Georgetown. We got 54 in Orangeburg, 57 in Walterboro, and 56 in Somerville. So a very chilly day. Temperatures should be topping out in the low to mid 60s for this time of year. But as you can tell, we are nearly 10 degrees below that only topping out in the mid 50s. Now, thankfully, it's going to be very, very sunny for your day tomorrow and also for your Thursday, but heading into your Friday in the upcoming weekend, our next area of low pressure will be coming out of the Gulf of Mexico, and this will lead to a very good chance of rain, especially as we head into the second half of your day on Friday and also the into the upcoming weekend. So if you like to watch any Christmas movies or want to binge watch any Christmas movies, this is going to be your, uh, your weekend to do so because I definitely recommend staying indoors considering how rainy it is going to be as we head into your Saturday and also into your Sunday. Let's take a look at your seven-day forecast. Very nice uh, cloud cover or sky cover to say the least for your day tomorrow and also for your Thursday, but still very, very chilly with temperatures only in the 50s. Overnight lows tonight in the upper 20s to lower 30s. Overnight lows tomorrow night in the low to mid 30s and then gradually starting to warm up back near normal as we head into your Friday and the upcoming weekend as this next weather maker approaches the area. Temperatures though still right around normal in the upper 60s to lower 70s, but a very rainy weekend is ahead to say the least. Hope you all have an amazing Wednesday.